हेलो टुडे इन दिस क्लास वी विल सी वेरी ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट प्रिवलेज एंड रोल्स इन औरकल डाटा बेस नाउ प्रिवलेज एंड रोल्स आर यूज टू परमिट ओनली सर्टन यूजर्स एक्सेस और प्रोसेसिंग कैपेबिलिटी ऑफ ए डाटा सपोज देर आर टेन यूजर्स फ्रॉम यू वन टू यू टेन एंड आई वॉन्ट टू परमिट ओनली यू वन एंड यू टू टू एक्सेस ए डाटा then i can do that with the help of privileges and roles privileges and roles are also used to apply varying limitations on user accounts and actions since uh, in this i am providing only two users the capability of accessing this particular data so i am applying varying limitations on the remaining users using privileges and roles there are three different types of privileges that you can study in a oracle database administration subject first is user privilege user privilege is the simplest privilege that can that one user can get uh, for example it is a right to run a particular type of sql statement right to run a particular sql statement or right to access an object right to access the object that belongs to some another user for example if there is a procedure or function created by user b then if user a has the privilege of accessing that particular procedure which is created by user b then that comes under user privilege so it is also an access to access the object created by another user next is system privilege system privilege is the privilege that allows the grantee to perform standard admin tasks so it is the one which is related to the admin task in the database the one which get system privilege can perform admin task for example it can create table space it can create table space tables or it can create users drop users alter user this particular privilege should be restricted and only provided to the user which are capable of handling the database administrative tasks so it should be restricted not everyone should get the access of system privilege next is object privilege it describes how to manage privilege for different types of objects in a database so it is basically related to the managing of privileges for different objects in database for different database objects for example update table selecting rows from another user's table or execution of stored procedure of another user that all comes under object privilege so select update execute etc and these all privileges are provided with the help of grant and the privileges are taken back with the help of revoke sql commands so this is all about the privileges now we will see very brief in a very brief introduction about the roles roles are created by users usually dba or the user which has system privilege to group together privileges or uh, other roles so it is basically a big entity being a big entity that contains privileges or other roles together it is used for basically quick and easy granting permissions to another users for example if i want to give all the privileges that comes under as connect feature of the database then i can create a role connect 
and grant that connect to the user so now it the question can be asked that how you can create a role so role can be created with the simple sql statement which is create role the name of the role suppose i am giving the name as manager and then identified by the password so this is the name of the role that you want to create and this is the password for that role 